My name is Pius Kabuswa. This boy is called Charles and he is 12 years old. Charles has a tumor on his belly button as you can see. Charles has been with this problem for over 10 years now. We were able to take him to Kasese Hospital and was examined, but he was referred to Malago Main Hospital for more examination and possibly get surgery from a neurologist, in that his bladder can be treated and also to cut off the tumor on his belly button as well as treat his urinary system. So this is the letter that we got from Kasese Hospital. At this point, we need financial assistance so that he can be operated. He needs two operations from two surgeons. One for his belly button and the other for his urinary system. Anyone in position to help, we need assistance to raise the money for these operations. The tumor started out small as a pimple, but with time, it grew bigger to this state it is right now. At this moment, Charles is not in school because of the infection he has on his bladder, he can't control urine and everything just passes through him, which creates a very unpleasant smell, which can't make him sit in a class with fellow students. I met this family during the floods that occurred in Kasese, where a lot of people's houses were destroyed and their property. So that is how I came to know them after meeting them in a camp which the local authorities had set up for people affected by the floods. This right here is his mother, but she's very poor and has no capability to pay for this boy's medical bills. The mother has 10 children, and this one is one of the last born. The mother didn't give birth from a normal hospital, but instead had a traditional healer who helped her to produce the baby, and she wasn't able to notice that the baby had some complications with his umbilical cord. That is where the problems began. The doctors have advised us to keep him very clean with a good hygiene so that he doesn't get any further infections because he is always passing urine from his bladder and no pumpers can even keep up with the rate at which he passes out urine which would require us to change his pumpers every 10 to 15 minutes. And he cannot play like other kids because when he tries he feels a lot of pain in his privates.